Chapter 8. Who is heavier? Hello, Priya. Today we're going to talk about weight. Look at both of us and tell me who you think is heavier. Abu, you are heavier than me because you are so much bigger than me. Well, you're right, but sometimes bigger things weigh less than smaller things. Look at a ball, for instance. The ball is filled with air and is light. Now, look at a 2 kg weight. The weight is small, but it still weighs more than the big ball. Let's see a few more examples of heavy and light objects so you can understand this better. Heavier and lighter. The apple is heavier than the leaf. The balloon is lighter than the ball. Now, you know that weight is measured in kilograms and grams. Here's 1 kg of popcorn and here's 1 kg of potatoes. Now, 1 kg of popcorn looks like it weighs more because there seems to be way more popcorn here, but they both actually weigh the same. Let's look at 1 kg of iron and 1 kg of cotton. Cotton is lighter than iron, so there's much more cotton than iron, but they still weigh the same. So let's play a game. I will show you many objects over here, and you have to order them by how heavy you think they are. We have an elephant, an apple, a table, a ball, and a brick. Let's order them according to what is the heaviest. Elephant, which would probably be the heaviest, so we would put that as number one. The next one would be table, so that would be number two. The third one, let's see, would be a brick. Good. And the fourth one would be a ball. And the last one, which is the lightest, would be an apple, which is number five. Good. Okay, let's do something else. Let's look at the things and try to guess what is the heaviest and lightest things that are around you, and how much do you think they weigh? What do you think is heavier out of the two objects? A bunch of flowers or bricks? Bricks, right? Well, if you said bricks, you got it right. Let's try another one. Your school bag or a water bottle? Well, your school bag must be definitely heavier than your water bottles, especially if you have a lot of books in them. When you go to the market and you buy fruits and vegetables, the shop owner uses weights to measure the fruits. So try observing how much the fruits weigh on the weighing machine. Next time you go to the market, look at the different weights that the shop owner uses. Well, I hope you enjoyed yourself learning about weight with me and Priya. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.